Hey everyone, I hope you're all well. Today is going to be an updated everyday makeup tutorial. A couple of things have changed. I do apply my concealer by hand now simply because I find that um, it's just a better way. And I also, I think I do my eyebrows a little bit thinner. So yeah, those are the main two things that have changed and I'm also going to be using a different lipstick. Okay, so first of all I do start off with a moisturiser and I usually moisturise with this stuff, this heavenly heavenly stuff. This here is Shea Butter or Shea Butter, however you want to pronounce it. I use Shea and Shea interchangeably just because just whatever comes out like Shea, Shea, Shea. I would start off with my eyebrows which are already done. The concealer that I use at the moment is this concealer and this is the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NW50. I would just squirt a, li a little bit on my hand. So as soon as you've got it on your hands, just put it all over. I just usually start with underneath the eye, eyes, <laughs> I have to, and then just all over and just kind of rub it like cream. Nice even finish. Until it kind of evens my complexion out. As soon as all the concealers rubbed in, you can already see that a difference has kind of taken place. Um, then after that, um, these days I'm using my uh, Studio Fix Fluid a lot more, squirting it out onto my hand. I'm going to use this bamboo bronzer brush. You know, you know that I love this. If you've watched most of my videos, I do love this brush. How do I move you? Just apply it. I always have cleansing facial wipes at the ready. I'm not getting ready in the bathroom, so I just want to kind of make it a quick process. But because I'm applying with my hands, I do have these at, at the ready. And these are actually a cheaper alternative to simple, fragrance free, and they are um, they are really good. Uh, you get 25 in a packet, and I think they go for 99 pence. I was going to say cents there, but we're not in. America. They're 99 pence and they sell in super drug. I usually stock up on them and I don't buy simple anymore. Sorry, simple. <laughs> After you feel like you've got enough foundation on, enough concealer and liquid foundation, then uh, you can use MAC Fix. This is a brand new pot. Looks like this. Just kind of dab it in and then push it into the skin. If you feel your lips are getting dry, just put on a bit of lip balm or Vaseline, whatever you have, and uh, moisturize. You don't want to get to the point of uh, putting, needing to put on your lipstick and then your lips are dry. Um, so after that, I usually proceed to blush. This is one of my favorite blushes. This is something I've repurchased. Maybe this is probably the third time I've. I'm repurchasing this particular shade. It's called Flushed. It says it there at the back, Flushed 935, and it is the darkest sleek blush. And it's perfect. Um, so, using a blush brush, I just rub it and place it. Rub it. And place it. And place it. Rub it. And place it. Don't worry about getting too much on. You can always dampen its brightness by using your um, powder brush. 
and then underneath my brows um, <laughs> I'm gonna use my sleek con it's funny like the only thing I use this contour kit for is the the highlighter yeah which is fine has a purpose still um, and then I just highlight underneath my brows This kind of never gets old to me. Um, can make it as um, subtle or as outstanding as you like. Let's put a bit on. Until you see that they're both of equal brightnesses and then you can move on to eyeliner this is just a L'Oreal Superliner Blockbuster it's pretty good because it's like a felt tip it's got it's pointy so yeah kind of makes it easier yeah I'm having quite a lot of breakouts on my forehead I don't know what that is probably an allergic reaction or something but hey these things happen nothing to go to get down about is it yeah so um i usually start from the inner corner and work my way out and i can pre do this pretty quickly these days And then once I've kind of got the overall line, my eyelid, and then work from the outside in to get the flick. So that is the flick right there. And I do the same thing for the other eye. And um, using this sleek pencil my trusty sleek pencil I do have another one but yeah I just keep using this one it's quite easy to travel with so I've just got it in my travel makeup bag yeah and so I do the bottom eye line too mascara that I have is called the volume clubbing mascara by bourgeois and yeah it's pretty decent so once I'm done with that there's only one thing left and that is lipstick I have this lip liner it's called Auburn and it's quite a, a burnt brown if that makes sense yeah yeah so this is all burnt up close a little bit on my hand it's quite bright on my hand and actually it does look like that on the lips once the lip liner is on I then use um, my lipstick paramount this is what it looks like on my hand just this one here and put it on and then once you're done with the lipstick I'm kind of going to just neaten up around my mouth in case uh, there's any over spill And that's it and this is the look really simple really easy and really natural so let me know what you think in the comments I will try and get back to you I do have Instagram and where I post there if that's where you prefer to be updated um, so yeah um, thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye